Last time on Let's Play Ocarina of Time, we met Princess Zelda, went to Hyrule Castle Town, and failed at the archery minigame. In between episodes, I went back and redid the archery minigame and won. It was actually really easy. I just had to listen to Applejack's archery tips and actually breathe and pay attention to what I'm shooting at. In this episode, uh, we're going to be uh, taking care of a couple of things that aren't have to do with the main quest, so we're doing side quests. First off, it's been uh, about a month since I've played this game. I hope I can remember what I'm doing here, but that shouldn't be too hard. I'm still early on in the game and I haven't really done much of anything. So, uh, first we're gonna be... Let's take a look at the map. We are in Hyrule Field right now, and I'm gonna be heading over to Lon Lon Ranch. No, don't save. I just want to exit out of the menu. Is that so hard to do? I don't know. Apparently it is. But, it, either way, I, uh, Lon Lon Ranch is just over here. Roll, 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 keep on rolling. It's a fun thing to do. Come on, Link, you're almost there. Yay, we're here now. Welcome to Lon Lon Ranch. And, uh, I hear somebody singing. Actually, I'm not sure if I do hear singing because I have the volume on my TV down really low so that it doesn't cause an echo with my microphone and the gameplay footage here. But, uh, let's go see, uh, what, uh, uh, Malin has to say. Oh, hey, it's, uh, a little Philly. Yes, I'm the fairy kid from the forest, and I did get your dad because he was asleep outside the castle. I did see the princess. It was, uh, pretty cool. So, yeah. Uh, your friend, uh, Epona. Uh, she seems a bit frightened of me. But yeah, she is cute. Not as cute as Fluttershy. Ahem. Uh, yeah. Epona is afraid of me. But that's because she's just a filly and is afraid of everything. Uh, don't quote me on that! Yeah, it's, uh... Okay. Yeah. I don't know how an ocarina, a musical instrument, can be cute, but okay. Auto-tune. Auto-tune. I wonder what song this is going to be called. Epona's song. Remember this for later. It will be important. After, eventually, uh, a few dungeons, game time, probably about a year with my upload schedule. I actually hope it doesn't take a year to get that far in the game. Hey, how's it going? Um, Epona, are you okay? Um, um, I, I need an adult. I need an adult. Oh, oh, thank God. Uh, that was, that was a bit freaky. But, uh, yeah. There's one more, two more things that we can do here at the, uh, ranch. First thing is over here in this house. I said in this house. Wow, that door was a lot farther away than I thought. Um, excuse me, sir. You look a bit too happy about what's going on here. Um, I didn't mean to do that. And yeah, so let's talk to 
Mario here. Oh, B, a monkey's uncle. You're the guy who helped me last month. So, I finally got my daughter in a good mood. What is going on here? Do you want to play a game? Okay, apparently those three chickens are super chickens. So you're gonna throw these into the room and we have to pick them out. And if we do that, we will get something good and yeah. Yeah. And uh, let's... Oh, one's right here. And this is gonna be a huge pain in the ass to find the other two. Okay, it's gonna be a huge pain to find the other one, because I didn't see where they landed. Holy crap, I can't believe I did that! That was amazing! I didn't even see where they went! Oh my god, I can't- that's- aw, oh, sweet! Wow! I've never done that so easily before! <sighs> yes, uh, because cowboys herd chickens, and not cows. Uh, eventually, maybe, but not right now? Oh, uh, you were? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, how about I see you in about ten years? Oh, it's milk that we get? Um, you don't actually need to buy a refill. I forgot that with this was milk, I actually thought that out of this you got a heart piece. Yeah, so milk is uh, pretty useful early on because it heals five hearts and uh, you can use it up to twice to heal ten hearts in total. And you don't have to talk to him to get refills of milk. Is there a golden skull tula in here? But let's roll on. There we go. I said die. Actually, no, I didn't. Now I said it. So that makes, uh, uh what, six skulltulas? Four. Not even close to what I thought. Wow. So uh, there's one other thing we can do at this uh, ranch for now. And that's over in that building over there. Let's, uh, get there fast by walking backwards because video game physics. Do 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 And we're here. Let's enter this house and say moo cows. Moo. Cow goes moo. I'll, I, I won't say. Let's just uh, push these boxes out of the way. No, don't climb. There we go. And now we move this this way. And now we crawl through here and there is our heart piece. And that makes two out of four. Come on, let's leave, let's leave. Get in the hole link. There we go, I knew you could do it. And now, there... Now we're done with the ranch right for now, so... Now we're gonna go to uh, Kakariko Village and tackle some stuff over there and see how well that goes. So we're gonna be leaving the ranch now. I do not know why I'm singing. It isn't even a tune that I know. Hey, look, there's a horsey now. I am really terrible at singing. But I guess if it's improvised, that's true. What the fuck did I just sing? Sorry about hurting your ears like that. But, uh... 
we are now entering Hyrule Field. And then remember what Impa said last month? That uh, Death Mountain is over there and uh, uh, so is Kakariko Village? Well, we're going to be tackling two things at Kakariko Village. And one of them involves chickens. No, I don't mean that kind of chicken. God, get your head out of the gutter, viewers. Wow, I know. That thing just says Kakariko Village, trust me. Pops! Welcome to Kakariko Village. Hey guard, what have you got to say? Ding dong! Clock soldier, time is currently 3.32. Hey. I don't really care what else you have to say, I just wanted to say ding dong. Uh, oh, that can't possibly be true. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, I'm done talking to you. Shut up, 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 shut up. There we go, thank you. Uh, uh, right now we, uh, I'm going to be collecting the different chickens across the town because uh, yeah, somebody lost her chickens and wants to get them back so yeah one is right uh, no don't climb up and then uh, then there's two but uh, we're gonna need its help to get over there so yeah and... Come on, pick it up, pick it up, there we go. Yeah, that is a little bit tricksy. Tricky. I don't know why I said tricksy, I must, I must be watching too much Super Genius, that's one of his catchphrases. No, 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 no! Uh, I want to go up the stairs and throw you out and then I want to climb up that ladder I said climb the ladder not roll into it there you go and now we have to pick up this chicken and, and uh, I do not even know how it got up here your guess is as good as mine viewers we Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! That's two. And I think, uh, if I remember correctly, there are seven or six. Come on, come on, pick pick up the chicken, Link. Pick up the chicken. There you go, I knew you could do it. And then this makes three. And then this makes four. Now that I think about it, I think there's only six. I don't remember. I've never actually took the time to count the chickens. And this one can be a bit tricky to get, but uh, I have a plan. I do not know if it will work. I do not want to go over there. Instead, I want to... Uh get it, uh, the chicken out of that box. Hey, get back here, get back here, get back here, get back here. Get over here, there we go. Okay, so my plan to, uh, get that other chicken is to get this one and then fly, well, yeah, fly across here. Uh-huh, gotcha. Um... I, I meant to do that. Get back here, get back here, get back here! Um, oh my god, I've never had this much trouble getting the chickens before. And after I just so easily gotten the chickens in Long Long Ranch, I'm having trouble with something that is infinitely easier. Wow. I can't believe that's happening. Why? Is that all of your chickens? 
Oh. Um. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh my god, I was right, it was seven. Holy crap. I actually remembered something. This is amazing! Actually, no, not really. The last chicken I should have remembered is up here. Right there. Thank you for not accidentally going in the house. I find it absolutely funny how we just float like this because of the chicken physics. And what do we get for returning all of your chickens? Uh, I'm not sure that's how allergies work. It's fine glass and should be useful. It is another bottle. We've got two of them now. And I'll show you exactly what I mean about uh, you don't have to pay for milk uh, at, from Talon at Long Long Ranch. Wow. I just realized why it's called Long Long Ranch. Talon Malon. Talon Malon Ranch. I am so slow. In this corner, the cow. We do not have to pay for milk because if we grab our ocarina and play Epona's song, then we will get free milk. Moo! Yes, it is a nice song. And, uh, why there's a cow behind bars is beyond me. That makes about as much sense as, uh, f uh, f uh, uh, not at all. Yeah, that's a good comparison. I'm gonna have to write that down so I don't forget it. And, uh, because we entered inside something, all the chickens are gone, and if you collect all seven of them again, you get to summon a dra- I uh, know, uh, you, uh, get 50 rubies from her. Also, in the- in the 3DS version of the game, these guys, uh, run even more flamboyantly, and it's hilarious. Welcome to the graveyard. One of the creepiest places in the game. And I'll, well, the entrance to one of the creepiest places of the game, which we won't be finding out for a while. Uh, what does this tomb say? Royal Family's Tomb. I am... Let's, uh, play, uh, the song of the royal family and see what that happens. What happens then. It's raining. It's pouring. Oh. God, uh... Frickin' flooring. What? Um, that doesn't look safe. You should probably move before it explodes and kills you. Okay, now it is time for us to enter the underground. Wow. That was way easier than I thought it was gonna be. Bat! And... Bat! And... Bat! I said bat! I said bat! I said bat! There we go. Bat? Die? There's only that many? Wow. We can't light these torches just yet. We are gonna have to wait until we get a way to make fire. Uh, frickin' frackin', this place is frickin' creepy. Ah! 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 Get away from me! Uh, I, I, I'm not sure if uh, mashing buttons actually helps you get out of their freeze state faster, but my god, those are freaking creepy enemies. And this is what we came down here for, the poem dedicated to the memory of the dearly departed members of the royal family. 
A rising sun will eventually set, a newborn's life will fade. From sun to moon, moon to sun, peaceful giving rest to the living dead. This is an interesting poem. That's actually written there. Oh look, something is inscribed here. Secret melody. It is called the Sun Song. And will be important. Well, kind of important. night time yeah basically the Sun song it, it advances between day and night which can be useful and it and it also and it also uh, uh, paralyzes the these three dead zombies and uh, it makes them makes it so that you don't have to put up with them in their freaky Ness. Yeah, haha, you can't get me. And, uh, it, it also uh, wears off after a while. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. I guess there is one more thing that we can do here at the graveyard. Now that it's nighttime, this creepy old codger is out. Hey, kid, don't mess around. I am Dompe, the gravekeeper. And uh, apparently this is based off of a Japanese folklore where you, if you have somebody ugly watching over your graves, they won't be haunted by evil spirits. I know, that is terrible. Heart Pound and Grave Diggin' Tour. I do not know why. Dompe has this kind of voice. Yes. Ten rubies to dig a hole. Dig a hole. Dig a hole. Oh, twenty rupees. Okay, come on. Hurry up. 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 I want you to dig here. Come on, one more step. There you go. Yes, I do want you to dig here. Come on. One rupee. What a ripoff. Okay, come on, Dampy. Move faster. Move faster. Come on. One more step. Two more steps. One more step. There you go. There you go. I knew you could do it. Yes. Yes, I do want you to dig. Oh, come on. One of these randomly has a heart piece in it, and knowing knowing how my luck is works, it'll be the last one, and it'll drag this video out longer than it has to be. Come on. Damn it! Well, screw you! Screw you so hard. Yes. Ah. Let's try this. Damn it. Oh, don't worry, I'll be getting you eventually. Yes, dig here. Come on, come on. Ah! 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 Come on! Game! You're gonna make me waste all of my money, aren't you? Please. No! No! Come on! Ah! Oh my god! Well, looks like I'm getting that heart container off screen. Ah, frickin' frackin'. Ah, 
There's another heart piece that we can get here. Well, actually, there's like three Skulltulas I can get here. I guess that's what we're gonna end up the video with. One right here. That makes five, right? One up there. Oh, man. That was... Uh, come on, game. Give me a break. You know, this is the game punishing me for taking so long to upload... to record this part. I just... can feel it in my bones. Actually, no, I can't. If I could, that would be incredibly creepy. And then there's our... There's our... There's our... There is our last Skulltula in this area. I hope. Oh look, there's a guy up there. He's, uh... He's, uh, just sitting on top of the roof. I'm just, uh, gonna... Go over there and say hi to him. Yeah, you're actually not supposed to get up here until much later in the game. But I'm showing off that you can do it now. Hey, good to see you again for the first time. Take this. If I had gotten the one from Dampy, that would have given me an extra heart container. But no! It had to go and screw me over just because it took me so long to... Upload a video. Oh, hey! Another spider! Yay! I was right, there is more here. How many spiders is that now? Eight. Well, anyways, uh, that's gonna be it for this episode. That is a whole, like, 28 minutes of nothing that just happened. I... Yeah, next time we're actually gonna move on with the plot and uh, go up Death Mountain and see what th there is there for us to do. See you guys then.